It's absolutely to a crisis point. When when our teachers are actively talking about a strike, I mean, there is no bigger emergency in education than that, in my opinion. Mason mom Wendy Spatz says she's been advocating for teachers and students throughout the lengthy contract negotiation process. Everyone seems to think this is just about money, and this is not just about money to every teacher I've talked to. The Mason School Board and Mason Education Association have been negotiating since February 14th. Union leaders say they're asking the board for a cost of living adjustment that compares to neighboring districts. They also want more time to collaborate on lesson plans and more say in their professional development. In a statement, the union spokeswoman says, quote, we continue to bargain in good faith and want to work collaboratively with the district to reach a fair contract deal that will provide the support our dedicated teachers need to continue empowering our students to reach their full potential. Mason School Board members declined an interview but responded in a statement, quote, we are dedicated to ensuring that our teachers remain compensated competitively at the top of the market. At the same time, we remain mindful of our resources and financial responsibilities to our community. The union says mediation with the school board will begin August 5th. But all we want is our teachers to go back with a contract and our students to have the support they need. I mean, that's what that should be everyone's common goal. I just I can't believe it's going on five months now. Well, striking is always a possibility when a contract ends, it's not required. Union leaders say they want to come to an agreement without interruption to students. In Mason, Chelsea Sick, Local 12 News. From breaking news to feel-good stories, Local 12 has it all. Tab subscribe and click the links for more content like this.